Each of the 21 innocent people killed in the Robb Elementary mass shooting has a story to tell, and sometimes it's a story that needs to be explained with more than just words. News for San Antonio's Amanda Henderson takes us to Eastman, Georgia, where a man is on a mission to do just that. It's a labor of love, making sure every detail is just right. I just hope it gives the families a little bit of peace. That's what keeps Sean Peacock and his team at Jazz Graphics going. They're in Eastman, Georgia, but their hearts are 17 hours away in Uvalde. I get up and pray for them. I stop during the day and pray for them. Peacock is referring to the 19 children and two teachers killed in the Robb Elementary mass shooting. Last Monday, he received a message from a victim's relative. They asked if Jazz Graphics could make their family a memorial bench. It's a tribute he first made for his mother out of a bench his late sister owned. It was an overflowing, overwhelming of emotions. I had to get up from my desk because I was crying so hard. His emotions led him to post about the tribute on Facebook, and it didn't take long for his town of about 5,000 to offer their help. There was several posts came right after my post that said, we'd like to donate toward this. There were so many people who wanted to donate towards these benches that Peacock actually made a GoFundMe. Within three days of when he was first asked about the benches, it had actually raised more than $20,000, meaning every single one of those 21 families will get their bench for free. I think it's miraculous. I don't think it's by accident. I think God's moved in a lot of people's lives. Peacock is working with one of the family members of the victims to let every family affected know about the offer. He's already finished several. The number on the bench represents when he completed each one. As you see, every bench has personal details, including a photo and a message of love. You are loved beyond words and this. He says they hope to deliver the benches in person in a few weeks, adding they'll be stopping along the way to have people pray over them before delivering it to families who are grieving the unimaginable.